In this short tutorial, I'm going to teach you how to calculate the specific charge on an ion. And this is now required in A-level physics. So let's do a worked example. So the question we're going to answer is, what is the specific charge on an Mg2 plus ion? So we've got magnesium that has lost two electrons, and we want to calculate the specific charge. And to do this, we're going to do it in three steps. So step one is to calculate the mass. And so we need to extract some data that we're going to require to calculate everything. So we're going to take the charge of an electron, the mass of an electron, the mass of a proton, and the mass of a neutron. And the key thing to notice from this data is that the mass of a proton and the mass of a neutron are identical. They aren't exactly identical, but to two decimal places, we can consider them as identical, and that simplifies the problem somewhat. And so we're going to take some data from the periodic table. So we know that magnesium has an atomic number of 12 and a mass number of 24. And you have to take care to make sure that you're using the right isotope. So a question may require a slightly different isotope. So you're going to have different numbers on here. And in this case, we've got 24 as the mass number. And because we're taking the mass of the protons and the mass of the neutrons to be identical, we can just multiply it by 24. If you wanted to do it more exactly, you're going to have to work out the number of protons and the number of neutrons with by subtracting the mass number and the atomic number and then do the multiplication with the different numbers. But in our case, we're taking the mass number and multiplying it by the mass of the proton slash neutron with us taking those two as identical. And that gives us a mass of 4.01 times 10 to the minus 26 kilograms. And we always work in SI units. That's why we're working in kilograms, even though it seems slightly absurd for subatomic particles. And likewise for charge, we're going to work in coulombs. So let's do step two, which is to calculate the charge. And we don't really care about the sign of the charge, so we're just going to neglect that for now. So the charge is very sim simple. We've got magnesium two positive, so that means that two electrons have been lost. So we just have to multiply the charge of the electron by two to represent the two electrons. So we do two times 1.6 times 10 to the minus 19. That's taken straight off our data table. And that gives us a charge on the ion of 3.20 times 10 to the minus 19, and we're working in coulombs. And so we're now on to the last step, which is step three, to find the specific charge. And the specific charge is simply the ratio of the charge to the mass. We substitute in the values from the previous parts, and so we've substituted for charge, substitute for mass. And when you do the division, you obtain a specific charge of 7.98 times 10 to the six, and we've taken the charge in coulombs and taken the mass in kilograms. So that's giving us coulombs per kilogram. And so hopefully you're now able to calculate the specific charge and that you found this video very useful. Thank you very much for watching.